Rise and shine. Not yet. I'm starving. Well, I guess that means I'm making breakfast. Wow. You even know how to work a toaster, rich kid? I am offended. Oh, too bad. I think there might be bagels in the fridge. We definitely check expiration dates on anything. Before you think about putting it in your mouth. Morning, Alfred. Oh, thank goodness. I was worried. I hadn't heard from you. I didn't know what happened if... if you were... I'm sorry, I didn't mean to worry you, Alfred. Well, I'm just glad you're okay. <sighs> I always fear the day you don't come home, Bruce. I know, Al. Where are you, anyway? I, uh... I stayed at Selena's last night. Oh. Well, that certainly explains it. I really like her. I'm sorry, are you smiling? You can't tell if I'm smiling. I know you, sir. While you're there, this might be a good opportunity to learn more about Miss Kyle. After all, we really don't know anything about her. See what you can find lying around, if she's trustworthy. You may not have another chance. I trust her, Alfred. That's all I need to know. If you're sure, at the very least, you can find that grapple gun of yours. Right. That might be harder than you'd think. She doesn't share your love of organization. Yes, well, I'll see you back at home, Bruce. This was an exhibit at the Gotham Museum of Art. I helped raise the funds for it. Lucius even set up new security for the museum. How did she get in? She can afford to eat anywhere and she still chooses Chinese takeout. That isn't even the good place. Pretty strong magnets on these things. Very lightweight though. They could use something like this. Scarlet Pimpernel, much ado about nothing. Petrarca. Hm. Didn't take her for a romantic. What's this one? Oh, the Gita Govinda. That's academic. Her cat eats like a queen while she's eating junk. There you are. I uh, hope she didn't break anything. <sighs> Vacation spots are just marks on her burglary checklist. It looks all right to me. Nothing growing, at least. At least she's got the essentials. Ah. Harvey. Hey. I, uh, I brought breakfast. C can I come in? I don't know if that's such a good idea. Just for a minute. I really need to talk to you. If you want me to go, I'll go. But I have to get this out. 
Bruce? What the... Seriously? What are you doing here? Have a seat, Harvey. No! I don't need to sit down. Bruce, tell me what is going on. I spent the night here. That's it. You... You... I can't believe this! Don't! Don't touch me! I thought I would come here and... So stupid! God, I should have known. I should have known that you would do this to me. Not if it was real anyway. God, how could you ever think it was? I shouldn't have come. So stupid! What are you talking about, Harvey? You two were never a couple to begin with. But you knew! You two done. You want something, you gotta say so. Nobody's responsible for your hurt feelings. He... he will not be able to protect you. And I don't need him to. Just... get out of here, Harvey. What happens when the children of Arkham come for him? You think you won't get caught in the crossfire? You can't stop them! He can't. Are you ready to die on that altar? I may go down for what my father did, but I won't take her down with me. She'll be fine. Ah, oh, funny. Thinking you have a choice. Thinking you can save the people around you. Thinking you can do what Harvey couldn't! I'm sorry. What the hell is going on with you? Up until now, Harvey has been weak. He's been afraid. Oh my god. This... This is the monster they all know that you are. Embrace it! No! No! Oh god, this is what you wanted to see, isn't it, huh? The freak! Harvey. Yeah. All right, now you've got two seconds. Or what? Harvey won't be pushed around anymore. No, he's gonna make them pay. Everyone who thought they could hurt him and get away with it! Starting with you. Both of you! You're gonna pick that up. Who am I? Yes, you are. This isn't you. Just calm down! <laughs> Shut up! Jesus, Harvey. Of course. Gotta be fair about this. Can't play favorites. They both deserve it. One way or another. <sighs> How about we flip for it? This isn't funny. No. No, it really isn't. Selena, looks like you're first. Yeah, always getting in the middle of things. Stay the hell away from me! The call's already been made! Harvey! Bruce! No! I don't want to hurt you! This isn't... They turned their backs on you! Harvey, put the knife down! <sighs> Selena! <sighs> He's gonna hurt someone! You know we can take him out. <sighs> Have you lost your mind? <sighs> no! <sighs> He's not gonna stop. Harvey! You need to calm down. What are you doing? No going back now. Come on, Harvey, that's enough. Oh, Bruce. <laughs> Please, not with him. But I can't. Oh, God, I can't listen to him. You need to get help. You can't deal with this on your own. <laughs> I know. <laughs> yeah, I know, I know. 
My fault. Harvey, don't. Bruce, I... I don't think we can help him. Not on our own. It's just me. It's just me. It's just me. It's just me. Just let me talk to him. You don't know what you're doing. He needs a professional. Please. All right. It's okay, Bruce. I'll go. I don't deserve your help. Go off with your tail between your legs. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Harvey! <sighs> so much for this place. I'm not gonna stick around and wait for him to come back. I thought it would be a while before I had to move again. That's what I get for wishful thinking. Yeah, you're right. It's not safe to stay here. And I'm not sure I'm gonna find another place with this kind of private access. Ugh. Maybe I'll live on a boat. <laughs> Kidding. Yeah. That means you too. We won't go far. Don't worry. You should... come stay with me. Uh... I don't know. There's plenty of space. Alfred could set up a guest room for you. I'll think about it. Great. What was that about? I'm supposed to announce my resignation at a press event today. Somehow try to appear happy that Oswald Cobblepot is taking my job. Sounds like an opportunity. How do you mean? They screwed you out of your own company. You have all this information that could bring them down, and they're handing you a live mic. So use it. Don't be their puppet. I need to warn everybody about the children of Arkham. They have big plans for Gotham. Hopefully they'll listen. You better get going. I've got some packing to do. The offer still stands. Sounding better and better by the minute. I'm sorry about all this, Bruce. We've... Uh, we've prepared a brief damage control statement to make this easier. After I introduce you, all you'll have to do is read what's on the teleprompter. And then I can take it from there. Got my little coronation speech just waiting. Thank you for being so cooperative about all this, Bruce. It really is for the best. For everyone, really. I know it's unfair to ask this of you, but please. Right now, your reputation, your entire legacy, depends on your cooperation. Get through today, and I can help you. I can convince the board to bring you back. It might not be CEO, but it will be something. A step to regaining what you're being forced to give up. This is what is best for Gotham. You're right. This is my legacy, and the only reason I'm putting up with this charade. Yes. Well, as long as you cooperate, I suppose your motivation is irrelevant. Already then, we are going to make quite a splash today, aren't we? I don't think I'm ever going to forget this day. Beautiful weather, corporate intrigue, a well-deserved comeuppance, a noble hero riding in to save the day. This really does have all the elements. Oh, don't worry, Oz. I'll make sure you remember every moment. Meaning? That's enough, both of you. It's time. Bruce, I'm going to introduce you and then you're on. Please, stick to the teleprompter. Good morning, everyone. And thank you for being here. Wayne Enterprises has always taken its role in the community very seriously. Isn't it funny? How everything I said to you in the park has come true. Me, taking everything that's yours. And that's not even a punchline. No, dear heart. Not even close. No one's gonna follow you around and take pictures now. It'll always be sad 
If you were so bloody handsome. You're just a pawn, Oswald. And everyone knows that pawns are meant Every to be sacrificed. Uh, perhaps. But at I least like I get the joy of watching your shocking and surprising descent first. This is just a first step towards making things right. Soon enough, it'll be Cobblepot Industries, Cobblepot Medical, and Cobblepot Tech on tops of buildings, and you, Waynes, will be what you should have been all along. A forgotten footnote. Cobblepot will come to mean the future of Gotham, and Wayne will be a story no one wants to hear. What the Waynes built would not have been possible without the Cobblepots, Oswald. I suppose you deserve it as much as I do. Bloody right I do. Catch you coming around to my way of thinking. Oh, I forgot to mention, I did some digging, and you know how old Hill admitted he had your mom and dad killed? I found out why he did it. Oh yeah, and I'll tell you the story, but only if you say, pretty please. It's quite the page, Turner. I'm sure you're just dying to hear it, aren't you, Bruce? Just tell me. I have to know. No, uh, uh, that's not what I asked. Pretty please. Turns out your dear mum found out what your daddy was up to. Threatened to turn him in, she did. She said she didn't want to be a part of it. Now you can imagine, Hill wasn't too keen on that idea. So he slid a few dollars Joe Chill's way and, well... You saw the rest, mate. And now, Bruce Wayne would like to say a few words. Remember, enjoy yourself, Bruce. After all, you never know how much time you really have left. I've been asked here today to lie to you, to regurgitate a script prepared by the company, all to hide the fact that I have been forced out. But I won't do that. I will not lie to save face. One moment, folks. Try that again, and I'll call security. I was horrified to learn of my father's corruption. I am ashamed of his actions and would like to apologize to Gotham for the pain he has caused so many of you. I'm sorry. That's it, mate. I worry for the future of Wayne Enterprises. The decisions made in the next few days will be critical in shaping what that future will be. Careful, Bruce. Mr. Wayne, are you having trouble reading the teleprompter? My so-called replacement, Oswald Cobblepot, is a criminal, not a businessman. His entire history has been faked. <laughs> oh, very oh funny, Bruce. Oh, my God. No joke between friends. Security. Step back, Mr. Wayne. Oh, that was quite a show you put on, Bruce. <clears throat> my apologies, folks. Please forgive me, Mr. Wayne. Everyone. I, for one, completely understand his behavior. Nice After statement. All, the press seemed to eat it up. I rather enjoyed it myself. Not that it'll change anything. I did what I felt was right. Yeah, well, someone has to. I just didn't think it'd be you. Dropped your pen. That's not... I should know. I'm sure some of you remember the form of beauty You feel that? That's a drug taking hold of you. Don't fight it. To the terrible things you... That happened to Gotham. You're with the children of Arkham. Of the dark no. I am the children of Arkham. So 
I think it's time you knew my real name. I am Lady Arkham. And you already know the Penguin. Look at him up there, taking everything that should belong to you. Mocking you, slug, insignificant bastard. He thinks he can get away with it. Because none of them know who he really is. They wouldn't believe you if you told them. And if we could just get one more round of applause for our friend, the man of the hour, Bruce Wayne! Someone's a little touchy, it seems. It would be so easy to get rid of him. Who else will deliver justice? Wow, they ended on that? That's a good way to leave it. Okay, decision time. What did I choose? I chose to help Officer Montoya instead of save Harvey. I did that because I felt like they were trying to make me feel guilty. Like, I know I messed him up, but whatever. And I kept my cool as Bruce Wayne. I'll beat him up as Batman. Really? I'd rather have Lucius Fox work for me. Give me upgrades. And of course I spent the night with Catwoman. Who wouldn't? And as I said before, I'm not going to beat up people as Bruce Wayne. I'm going to beat up people as Batman. If you guys like this video, make sure you drop a like, get ready for episode 5, and I'll see you guys later. Peace!